Hey guys, I'm back to the channel. Today we are going to be looking at some leaked stuff coming to Prodigy, so let's get into the video. Alright, so we have some new Spring Fest leaks to look at, so let's go ahead and look at them. So first off, we got our armor for this Spring Fest added into the game. It's not obtainable yet, but you can get it with hacks. So the first one that we have is the Simple Flower Bush, which is right here. It looks pretty similar to our current Flower Bush. Just a little bluer and with different colored flowers. So this is what it looks like. It has a heart bonus of 140, which I think is probably the highest that we have of any stat for a mount. So I think that's kind of decent. Um, we also do have a new buddy, which um, is right here. The Benedict. Um, for some reason, you can't see the icon for it nor can you see it in game for some reason but that is in game we do have some boots as well we have the unicorn slippers i don't know if these are going to be part of spring fest at all i assume not but just going to say that they were added into the game i don't know how they're going to be implemented though but they do have a speed bonus of 255 which seems to be the default for a lot of stuff right now um, I don't think that we got any new relics. Yeah, we did get some new wands, though. Um, I'm not sure why some of the icons or stuff is just not showing up. Um, but we have the Fox Cavalier brand, which does Flame Burst, Power Bonus of 243. Okay, so now um, we're finally loading in. But you still can't see this stuff. Um, this is also known as a Silver Fox Blade, which... I assume this is the Silver Flox Blade that we saw in a different video that I'll uh, try to put up in the cards. Um, they're highly coveted, but owned by very few. Next up, we have the Fox Page Blade. I don't know which one this is, but it does Kindle, a power bonus of 204, using a special blue alloy known only to a secret clad of Foxsmith Masters. We also have the Bunny Vanguard Lance, which is right here. And this one does Leaf Spiral Power Bonus of 204, made from a special Carrot Beat Hybrid Extra Sweet for when you're thrust into a prickly situation. So the Bunny Wands are going to be associated with plants, I guess. Or, I don't know why I said that. I don't know why this heart is here. I don't think that's ever been there. Um, if we, like, go to this. Yeah, there's no heart. I don't know why that's there. Um, and then the final one, the Bunny Warden Blade, does Leap Swarm Power Bonus of 243. So, yeah, that is all of the uh, wands. We do have some gear as well. Starting off with the Blossom Doublet, which we sort of or we know what this looks like um this does defense bonus of 256 made to attract even the most wandering of eyes it's pretty or it's pure poetry of cloth and motion and as you can see these stu this stuff is not going to appear it just makes you naked for some reason um next up we have the fox cavalier armor um i assume this is probably 243 yeah this one's probably like 204. So yeah, um, Bunny Warden is going to be 243. Bunny Vanguard is going to be 204. And then hats, those aren't going to appear either. I don't know what Bunny 3 is. I don't know what this one's supposed to be. It doesn't have a description or anything. And then we have the Bunny Outlaw Hood, which um, I think that's the yellow bunny hood that we saw we also have the blossom crown fox champion helm fox cavalier helm fox page helm bunny vanguard cap and bunny boarding cap so those are all of the items we do also have some other leaks that we can look at so let's go ahead and look at those so starting off um, we are going to be getting like a new animation for the all out attack it's going to look i guess they're making it hd or rasterized whatever you call it i think before it was pixelated but they updated it so i haven't tested it out but it should look different now next up 
we have a new UI for Springfest. So you can see most of this stuff you've already seen before, like this, this, this. Um, the only really new ones are this thing right here, um, this background, this icon or whatever you'd call it right here, and then this, which I guess is like saying to search for eggs or something like that. And we also have this. This is supposed to be some sort of like member um, thing. I don't know what it's called though. And also this egg right here is new. We did actually get like some sort of new icon for each one of the festival currencies, which we are going to look at in a few seconds. So next up, yeah, we did get new icons for uh, Pumpkin Fest, so this is the new candy corn, or I guess it's not the new icon, it's just like a different part of it. And then, yeah, this is the same thing. This is for the Springfest UI. This is called Icon Springfest Banner. So what I think this is probably is um, when you load into, or you pull up the UI for uh, Springfest, this is going to be one of the things that's at the top, I'm assuming. So this is new. We also have Info Rewards Cycle 2. So I think these are probably going to be the rewards for this spring fest. So we'll get Clove Rat, um, whatever this page is called. Obviously spring works. And then I'm um, not sure what this is called. It is a house item though. I know that much. And then I believe this is what we got last spring fest. So we shouldn't get this this spring fest, which is good. And then this is one of the Springfest icons that was in game, or in the UI. You can see more of it here. You can see that there's the, sort of like the Academy in the background. And then we have Don Zorro and Harriet, whatever her name is right there. So this is called Springfest 1. We also have Springfest 3. There's no Springfest 2. Um, this is Springfest 3. This is like search for the eggs that are hit or are on the ground or something that have the exclamation point or something over it because that is something that they could put into the Springfest UI. Next up, this is the background. I'm not sure if they're just sh overall sh I don't know where this is going to pop up. That's pretty much it. Um, it doesn't look super related to Springfest, but yeah. Next up, um, this is just the Summerfest background, or er, not background, this is going to be the new art for the Sand Dollar. And then, yeah. Then next up I believe is Winterfest. Yeah, so here's the new Snowflake. It looks pretty good. And then there's another Snow... But then we also have this new thing that's called UI Shared Revamp. I think that this is probably going to be for Wizard Watch. In fact, it could possibly be in Wizard Watch. No, it is not. Um, I don't know what it's going to be for. There's supposed to be some, like, wood a part of it. So yeah, there's this, like, wood thing. There's this, like, pink dot right here. And then this gray thing. I don't know what that's supposed to be for. Alright, so moving on into the data, we do have a few things to look at. So we have this thing, which uh, this has to do with buying Magicoin, I believe. OTP cooldown body, you just bought some magic coin, try again in a few minutes. So you can't buy magic coin right after you bought some. And then we have feature unavailable here. This feature is unavailable here. I assume this is probably for like school hours or something. In fact that this might be in game already. Um, quest play battle fights blank battles. That's not great grammar, I think. But it seems like we're going to be getting something called Quest. These could be for Springfest, I don't know. We do also have Quest Play Rift Battle Fight Blank Rift Battles, Quest Play Loot Dash Battles, Do Blank Wizard Dash Battles, Quest Purchase from Bunny Shop, Buy Blank Items from the Bunny Shop, that could be hard if you already have completed that. Um, then we have Quest Win Loot Dash, Win Loot Dash, Win a Dual Stadium Battle, um, claim 
treasure track items, or as they call it, battle pass. Quest complete, festival stages complete, blank festival stages. Quest purchased from Fox Shop, purchase blank items from the Fox Shop. And then this final one is Ultra Upsell per month. I don't know what this one's going to be for, but it seems like we're going to be getting some sort of quest. I don't know if they're going to be for Springfest or not, but we'll just have to wait and see. And moving on to the metadata, we do have a few things. Um, so the site of Spring, which I think is probably our house item for the treasure track. Wait, not the treasure track. Springfest. Um, it seems like it's been updated to the member. I don't know if you can actually use member house items. I kind of feel like you can if you're not a member, but I'm not sure. And its rarity was updated to, I believe that's rare. Um, and then a bunch of the Fox stuff got their affinity, which is like association, updated to be fire. And um, the bunnies got their stuff to be updated to plants. So this is for the bunny bandit. Its affinity was just updated. Not really anything too special. Um, this is Benedict. This is the egg that we are unable to see. Someone tried to cook this egg, but it got away, and now it's on the run. So, I think we already saw this has a health of 30. I don't know if this price is going to matter at all. I think it's 330 magic coin, which I don't think you're going to buy it. But we'll just have to wait and see. Now, this final thing that I want to talk about could be a little concerning. Here we have the new hats from the metadata. Bunny Warden Cap. It says price of 150. I don't know if that's going to be in Magic Coin or um whatever the Spring Fest currency is called. But if it's Magic Coin, that would be really annoying because you'd have to spend 300 at least to get one set, because like every single one is 150 Magic Coin as of now, if it actually is going to cost Magic Coin. I'm kind of hoping that they sort of revamp how they do um, the festival rewards, but we'll just have to wait and see if they're actually going to do that, because it would be really annoying to actually have to spend magic coin to get these new items if we haven't actually been able to get really any new items in the past two years. So yeah, that is going to go ahead and end up the video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, and bye.